What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Thorns Gaming. I've got your Friday night Fortress Siege here in Lineage 2 Revolution for you this evening. This is number 49 in the series. We are one week away from number 50. It's been a long time coming. We haven't even made it a whole year's worth, but hey, I'll take number 50. Uh, hopefully that'll happen next week. We've got a great fight tonight. Hopefully, great fight tonight. There's not as many fights tonight as there were last week, but we still got a, a, a decent amount, at least. And I can't wait to see this one. One of the ones I did, actually, just last week, and the other clan I have never done before at all. So let's get into it. And here we have it at the number 5 Fear Factory. 292,066,983 combat power in totality for their clan. And the number 7, Potatoes, 288,298,332 combat power in totality for their clan. I'm looking at a little bit less than 4 million combat power between the two. That means absolutely nothing. We know that. The other fight that is actually worth of note, Ataraxi at 289.6 million and ABC at at 293.3 million. Again, very close in combat power between those two. That's, uh, this is going to be good. And Fear Factory wasn't last week. FSK was last week. Fear Factory was two weeks ago when they fought Legendary, and that was when there was still a gate bug. So I don't actually consider that video a real video. Because nobody could figure out how to get into the gate. Very few did. Let's see what was paid. This is for an S-grade fortress. Fear Factory play paid 1 million flat for the right to challenge potatoes for this S-grade fortress. The ABC Ataraxy? R-grade. The SR-grade? Well, Impact only has 19 members. So I can pretty much be assured that Redemption is going to win that and... I don't know who Chaos is, but they are very low in the combat power. So I'm beginning to think that they might be an alternate clan. Uh, nobody, again, second week in a row, third week in a row, nobody bit against the Mega Squad. That's fantastic. Those two, this is a fixed fight. Those two are actually allied with each other. They're both Brazilian clans. And as far as the A's and B's, nobody cares. So let's head into the battlefield. All right, I've got a minute and 20 seconds left. So let's find these leaders quickly, if I can. Oh, there is Potatoes Leader. Potatoes in the blue. On the top, the Defenders. Pre-Tato, or Pre-Tato, however you want to say it. Leader of Potatoes. Good luck to Potatoes. Let's head on down to Fear Factory. Fear Factory in the red. On the bottom, the Attackers. I will be following the Attackers as I normally do. And we are going to see if we can find their leader. I have very bad eyes. I'm not seeing their leader. They may be on over here. Let's head over here. And there is their leader, Wynand. Good luck to Fear Factory. Ten seconds before we begin. Five seconds before we begin. And here we go. Fortress Siege number 49, Potatoes versus Fear Factory. Fear Factory did very well against Legendary, uh, despite the gate bug. We will see how they are going to do against Potatoes. Fear Factory is ahead in CP, but that actually doesn't mean anything, as we well know. Potatoes interrupted. Fear Factory not doing anything. Potatoes trying again. Honey, I don't see any Fear Factory up there. Potatoes over halfway. Fear Factory has been interrupted. Potatoes. Interrupted with about one second remaining. Good interruption on Fear Factory's part. Fear Factory trying again. Potatoes tried, interrupted, tried, interrupted. Fear Factory interrupted, trying again. Interrupted again. Both teams trying. Fear Factory interrupted twice there. Potatoes approaching the halfway mark. Over halfway. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. Tempest and buff. For the next three minutes for Potatoes, and they're going to come flooding on down here to Fear Factory, who has already been interrupted. Potatoes, part of the Party Alliance. Fear Factory, part of the Resistance. Potatoes, over halfway on imprinting Fear Factory's altar. 
Potatoes. Interrupted. Potatoes trying again. Interrupted. I had a few people tell me that this was not going to be that phenomenal of a fight. Dados has already doubled the kills on Fear Factory here in the first two and a half minutes of this battle. Dados over halfway. Three seconds. Interrupted. It was over halfway again. No red here whatsoever. Oh, nope. And 30% buff for the next one minute. 11 seconds for potatoes. Those towers are still healthy. The red team's defense tower has been destroyed. The red team's gate. There goes the non-spawn gate of Fear Factory. Tato already there. Boy, if this battle ends quickly, I'm going to head over to the Adaraxi ABC at party. Party? Yeah, that that little party, that little shindig they're having. Less than 30 seconds remaining in Potato's 30% buff. This holy artifact defense tower is gone. Giving some breathing room to the leader of Potatoes. And there goes 30% buff for potatoes, but they're already getting it back. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. 30% buff for the next one minute and 28 seconds. What Fear Factory is doing? What are they doing there? Are they trying to take down a, a tower? They sure are. It's, it's gonna be a little bit more difficult when you don't have any buffs. I mean, look at it. They're standing there. They're beating the crap out of it. It doesn't look like they're doing anything to it. The blue team has started imprinting the holy artifact. The blue team has failed to nope. imprint the holy artifact. The blue team has started imprinting the holy artifact. The red team's tower has been destroyed. There goes the... Eight seconds before Potatoes wins this battle. Four seconds. Quick battle. Two seconds. And congratulations to Potatoes for successfully defending their S-grade fortress. Congratulations to Pringles, taking number one for Potatoes, and Nico, number one on Fear Factory side. Here are your stats. I will get through these as quickly as possible. That was a fast fight. Fear Factory, you did well against Legendary. Not so well against Potatoes. Good fight, though, on Potatoes' part. I will head over to the Adaraxi ABC fight after this. Already starting to see some dashes. On Fear Factory side, wow, that's a lot of dashes on their side. But then again, they didn't really have much time to get a number. There are your stats. Let's head on over to the other battle. All right, there is Adaraxi leading the kills against ABC At. I see Adaraxi still has both of their defense towers on their gates. The spawn side of ABC. A little bit of damage there. How about the other side? The non-spawn gate is down. The blue 
team's defense tower has been destroyed. ABC, over halfway in their altar imprint. Three seconds, two seconds, one second, 10% buff for the next three minutes for ABC at... <laughs> we'll just call him ABC. There we go. I don't know why that zoomed in. The blue team's gate has been destroyed. And there goes the non-spawn gate of Ataraxi. I guess I should be following ABC around a little bit. There's their leader. That looked like Road Runner. Road Runner, leader of ABC. The altar of Earth and printing has been reset. And they're actually trying to go for their altar. Interrupted. Johnny Feller, leader of Ataraxi. I think we probably know this by now. And they're actually interrupted again. Ataraxi, part of the Party Alliance. And no kidding, ABC, part of the Resistance. Ataraxi over halfway. Ataraxi with a slight lead and kills. Ataraxi interrupted. Interrupted it again. ABC, 50 seconds left remaining in their 10% buff. Both teams' non spawn gates are down. I do not know if anybody has gotten Holy Artifact Inference time. ABC is now interrupted. They were starting to get Ataraxi's imprint. Big battle going on here for, A for Ataraxi's altar. But ABC has 15 seconds remaining in their 10% buff. And there goes ABC's 10%. ABC interrupted Ataraxi. Got a little breathing room there. Over halfway, interrupted. Halfway again there for Ataraxi. The blue team's defense tower has been destroyed. There goes a holy artifact defense tower of Ataraxi. Sent a little squad up there to help give breathing room to ABC's leader. Not a team able to get the 10% buff right now. Under actually interrupted, ABC interrupted. Well, this fight is definitely better than that last one, that is for sure. Actually, over halfway. Interrupted.
ABC with the lead. Well, Adorexi was interrupted. Can Ad Adorexi did in interrupt him. Good job. 18 minutes remaining in this battle. Adorexi going for both now. Interrupted on both. ABC, interrupted. Adaraxi over halfway, interrupted. Wow. Good defense by both teams in the last few minutes. Adaraxi, interrupted. ABC, interrupted. Man, they are so close. They just can't, can't get to the end. Adaraxi over halfway. Adaraxi, three seconds, two... Oh, interrupted. ABC. Interrupted. Wow. Neither team can get any kind of foothold and momentum going. However, nope. Adaraxi interrupted again. We'll turn it back around. Adaraxi trying. Over halfway. Interrupted. Wow. This is phenomenal. Well, I wish I knew who has gotten holy artifact imprint time. There goes the final holy artifact. Defense tower 30% or I'm sorry 10% buffer Adaraxi for the next three minutes finally somebody managed to get one ABC got it uh, they got a, a bit of time there I don't think I've ever seen Adaraxi have any any issues with people, but then again, they've only fought what Impact and one other pre one other clan. Well, that I've seen, you know, in my recordings. But ABC is definitely giving them some problems right now. If they get that 30% buff. They could definitely try to push Johnny Feller into getting some time. I believe ABC fought Redemption and lost last week. So they are trying. The blue team has started imprinting oh, there goes Johnny Feller. He got some good time, and there goes a Holy Artifact Defense Tower. Of ABC. And Adaraxi. Oh, almost had that 30% buff. What was I saying before? Oh, ABC. Having lost last week. Trying to turn things around this week. With a win. 30% buff in the next 45 seconds for Adaraxi. We're waiting, we're waiting, we're waiting. Or we're waiting as they try to get through the choke point. There goes Johnny Feller.
Johnny Feller allowing his teammates to clear the way. Which they have done so, more well, more or less, until the second wall went up. He's running up to it. And there he goes. He got stunned out of that, though. And there is my few. ABC. Trying to get some time. Uh-oh. Oh, they got it down to three seconds. I bet that head had her actually sweating. They got a 30% buff for the next 1 minute 17 seconds, so... I'm sure that head had her actually sweating a little bit, getting it down that close. I saw two different uh, things going off. I think both teams' leaders were in a printing. I didn't even know whom to go to. It's anybody's guess who's winning this in Holy Artifact imprint time right now. Come on, let's go. Good grief. Out of actually only 30 seconds remaining in their 30% buff. Oh, wow. They are down here in force. Trying to take out this... There goes one. And good meteor shower. There goes the spawn gate of ABC. Oh, he's getting some time now. Eight seconds before Adaraxi wins this battle. Four seconds. And congratulations to Adaraxi for successfully defending their R grade fortress. Congratulations to Nobu for taking number one. And Ice I Apollo for ABC taking number one on their side. Here are your stats. That was definitely a better fight than the Potatoes Fear Factory one. That is for sure. ABC definitely gave Adaraxi a run for their money. Getting it down to three seconds. And that was just the one that I saw. I have no idea what they did in the, uh, what, the ten minutes or so before I was able to get into that battle. Fantastic. Great job by Adaraxi. Fighting off a clan from another server. Now all part of Lamel. Oh, look at that. My future ex-wife is second to last and shrine last place for Adaraxi. Great job. There are your stats. All right, so we know Redemption won that one, and of course Yangari won that one. Transcendence FSK still going. Spectator list is full, so good luck to those two. Adaraxi, congratulations. Korea won. Legion, Potatoes. Well, we know they didn't. Sincerity, Oblivion, Shiva, Olympus, Sinner's Paradise, and Royal Club. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. And hit me up on Discord or Twitter. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.